Hey, you guys, welcome back to my channel. So this past Sunday, another episode of Sister Wives aired. And in the episode, Cody pretty much admits that he lied to Christine, allowed her to get her hopes up that they would possibly move back to Utah before switching the way he felt um, and then siding with the other sister wives once they all got together. In the episode, Mary kind of calls him out. She's like, you know, you lied to her over something that meant a lot to her. Once again, showing us just how much of a douche lord Cody Brown can be. So we're going to talk about it, you guys. You know, not that we was unsure of the fact that Cody can be a douche and he does not think about his wife's feelings but this just once again kind of showed us that he just don't think about it like he just he doesn't have the slightest idea why it means a lot to christine and how telling her like mm, yeah it's something i could think about and then when getting together with his other wives and them saying not interested not interested not interested and him saying yeah no not interested why that has such an effect on christine he just don't even understand so on Sunday night's episode of Sister Wives, Cody talked about Christine's desire to move back to Utah. Now, this has been a discussion um, since last season, like especially since like the end of last season. Um, this past spring's season 15 finale of Sister Wives, Christine was very vocal about where she wanted to live, that she wanted to be in Utah. She got very angry and sad when Cody appeared to have her back and agree with her, only to then change his stance and side with the other wives. Now, following the rejection by Mary, Janelle, and Robin on the finale and following her husband's agreeing with them that he wanted to remain in Arizona, Christine took a walk with Mary in that season finale, and that's where she she said that line that I've kind of seen everywhere. I can't do marriage with Cody anymore. I made a video about it. I think every YouTuber that covers Sister Wives, they made a video, and you know, the title was I can't do marriage with Cody anymore. That's where she made that comment, and it was coming from the conversation of moving, and Cody seeming to agree, but then change his mind as soon as the other girls were there with them. Now, a few months later, Christine proved that that was not some empty threat that she was making because she did, in fact, leave Cody. On Sunday's episode of Sister Wives, which was filmed months ago, Cody sat down with Mary and had a discussion about Christine and the fact that she wanted to move. Now, in this meeting with Mary, he talked about how he initially handled the talk with Christine about moving away from Flagstaff and back to Utah. He said, I've got to admit, I tried to be stoic with Christine. I was like, yeah, I'll move. I'm game. Oh yeah, I've always been interested in returning. That's where I thought I would retire, in St. George, Utah. And Mary calls him out. She said, so you lied or you misled Christine about something that meant a lot to her, in other words? She called Cody out, and it definitely seems like he lied. Or he misled her, just to kind of keep her happy for that moment. Knowing that he could get with the other women in front of her, and because they would outvote her then it wouldn't just be on him. You know, he could be like, well, I said I was fine with it. But still, it, it hurt her to see that not only did Cody flip, but then when she was emotional and upset about it, he didn't even try to comfort her. I don't see Cody try, trying to comfort any of these women. It's very strange. So when Cody was asked by Mary if he actually wanted to move, um, he just, he said no. He was like, no, I really don't want to move. You can't be Flagstaff, Arizona, can you? You just can't. So once again, it just showed that he said that to Christine to just kind of satisfy her for the time being. Um, in the episode, though, he suggested that Christine was potentially experiencing a midlife crisis because he is such a sympathetic and caring husband who tries really hard to understand what his sister wives are going through, that she just must be having some sort of midlife crisis that has her acting this way. Like he's literally suggesting that Christine cannot want to move back home and be emotional over the fact that he lied to her um, and then flipped, you know, in front of the other girls with the other girls He's saying she can't be emotional about that. Maybe she's going through some midlife crisis for the fact that she got emotional over that and she's acting this way. Now, Mary 
when she discussed, you know, how she felt in regards to moving, she said, thinking of moving to Utah, honestly, my gut instinct is, oh, hell no, not interested. I never had the desire to move back, but she did at least recognize that she felt bad about the way she felt because she knows how important this move is to Christine. She said, honestly, I hate the fact that she may be feeling trapped. Um, she said that to Cody, but then she follows it up with, I mean, I don't know if that's how she feels, but I do wonder. Yes, your girl was feeling trapped. When I was watching the episode, and this has been discussed before, that they take a vote, you know, that they don't, uh, you know, take turns. It's not like, okay, well, this month we're going to whatever Robin wants. Next month is whatever Christine wants. Next month is whatever Janelle wants. Next month is whatever uh, Mary wants. They don't do that. That it's always, they take a vote and the most votes wins. Um, and that's just kind of the way they do things. And that Cody is outvoted a lot because the girls usually tend to kind of vote together for the most part. Um, but yes, of course it feels her leaving trap because she's living in a, in a state with no, um, family outside of, you know, the sister wives and Cody, but even then they don't see each other a whole lot because they're still trying to do social distancing due to COVID, right? And she don't really have a marriage like to stay there for. So I'm happy that she left. I'm happy to see that Christine is in Utah watching her on Instagram. Every time she makes a post, she is smiling bigger than she's ever smiled before. She is glowing with happiness. You can just see it. Like she, she just went through her first Thanksgiving as a single woman. Um, and she looks so happy, right? So I'm happy to see that she is happy. I'm glad that she took those steps and moved back. It's, I don't think it's okay, you know, that she would have had to stay there and be miserable, right? How do you guys feel about that? But I thought, wow, as I was watching the episode, when he was acknowledging that he fed Christine a load of crap just to kind of please her at the moment, but then, you know, turned around and changed the way he felt about it when all of the other girls were there with him and everyone else said, no, I have no desire. Well, then he was like, yeah, no, me, not really me either. And it really upset Christine. And she had to walk away because she was so upset and she didn't even get any comfort from Cody. Like, Cody, you lied to the girl. She was blown away. I do remember Christine in the confessional being like, what? Like, this isn't what Cody said. Like, Cody gave me hope. And now he's just kind of squashing that. So that actually kind of went down, you know, on last season. But on this season, it was brought back up when Cody had the discussion with Mary. And he outright told Mary, like, yeah, well, I kind of played into it a little bit, all the while knowing that I didn't want to move. And I knew it wasn't going to happen. I played into it a little bit. So I wanted to talk about that because as I watched the, the episode, I was just like, geez, this is why you're such a douche. Like, you shouldn't have done that. You should not have lied to her just to appease her for that moment uh, and then turn around and have to hurt her by telling her the truth and then don't even comfort her. That was such a terrible move. But you guys leave me your thoughts. Did you guys watch the episode? If you watched it, what did you think when you saw that scene where he acknowledged to Mary that he basically lied to Christine? And then in the episode, even um, insinuated that maybe she was going through a midlife crisis. How did you guys feel about that? Leave me your thoughts in the comment section below. Are you guys happy to see that Christine is moving on and she is happy in her life as a single woman? And I know... Everybody always comments on my videos and they're like, she was never married. And I'm like, I know she, but in her mind, she was, she was spiritually married. So I say that she is single now and that she was, obviously she's going through a spiritual divorce, right? But you guys let me your thoughts in the comment section below. Make sure you give this video a huge thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. And until next time, I'll see you guys later. Bye everyone.